Hi, this is Andrew with Infinity Cutting Tools. Today I'm excited to give you a quick look at two Infinity exclusive products. The Venturi Vacuum Switch, which now includes the correct fitting to quickly and easily attach your air compressor hose to the Venturi, and also the new vacuum gauge accessory kit that comes with a one and a half inch vacuum gauge and the correct fitting to make it quick and easy to attach the gauge to your Venturi so that you can monitor and fine tune the amount of vacuum that you create with your Venturi. Let's go ahead and take a closer look. I've got my Venturi vacuum switch all set up here with my quick connect fitting to attach my air compressor hose to as well as the vacuum gauge accessory kit that's going to allow me to monitor how much vacuum I'm creating with the Venturi. With an output pressure from my air compressor of about 80 psi, I'm going to be able to produce a negative 26 inches of mercury on the vacuum gauge. Just to equate that to a number that you may recognize if you're not used to using vacuum clamping, that's going to produce about 2,000 pounds per square foot of clamping force. If you had a 12 inch square piece of material, you would need roughly seven standard duty bar clamps to produce that much clamping force. And it's definitely not going to be nearly as consistent as you would get from the, a vacuum clamping job. Let's go ahead and get everything hooked up. First, I would connect my air compressor hose, just like that. Then I would take my eight millimeter vacuum hose, attach it to the Venturi, just like that. Now I'm ready to throw the switch and do my clamping. One of my favorite uses for the Venturi vacuum switch here in the Infinity Tool Shop is with the oval and circle cutter with vacuum base. To use these tools together, all I have to do is connect my eight millimeter hose from my Venturi to the base of the oval and circle cutter. Then flip the switch on the Venturi and use the oval and circle cutter to cut whatever shape I need for my project. When I'm all done, I simply turn the Venturi switch off and I can remove my oval and circle cutter from my project and I have no marks on my workpiece itself. I no longer have to worry about having to fill little screw holes or pin holes from attaching the base of my oval and circle cutter. If you've ever wanted to give vacuum clamping a try, the Venturi vacuum switch may be the perfect solution for your shop. Don't forget to check out the Infinity Tools blog for more information on the Venturi vacuum switch as well as a ton of other information on general woodworking and tools. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can be first to see new videos from us here at Infinity.